Good morning, lovelies. Zoe Two Dots here. We are up in Arakuriyama, and I couldn't think of a better place to. Uh, I couldn't really think of a better location to uh, encounter Mew than like up at a giant temple in the mountains in front of Mount Fuji. So uh, cherry blossoms are in full bloom as well. So I'm gonna have a bit of fun with this encounter, I think. So let's uh, claim that daily reward and let's go over here. Mythical discovery. Claim, claim, claim. We're also gonna hit level 49, I'm pretty sure. So let's pop out here. No? Oh, so close, okay. I thought I was gonna hit 39. I thought I had calculated correctly. All good. Let's claim our Mew. Ultra Balls. I'm gonna have a little bit of fun with this, so I'll be back in a second. <laughs> The game's actually being quite peculiar at the moment. Um, I'm getting, like when it goes into AR Plus mode, it's getting incredibly pixelated. Um, it's like almost potato quality. So I don't think I want to catch my Mew just yet. So don't hate me, <laughs> don't hate on me. I just want to get a few really good photos with Mew. So I did get a couple, um, I restarted the app and I did get a few clear photos um, with Mount Fuji in the background. So I'm definitely really stoked to have those, but I think there's just so much more, like so many more opportunities to photograph Mew uh, in Japan while I'm here and I've run away from it and re-encountered it several times and it's still there It's not right. It's not going anywhere. So um, I'm gonna keep I think I'm gonna carry it in my backpack um, For a few more days. I think I think I'm gonna take a few pictures in Osaka I think that'd be really cool to have some photos there of Mew. So no shade But I'm gonna be carrying this Mew around for a little while longer. I'm not gonna catch it just yet. So where have you guys been catching your muse? Um, have you been having some crazy photo ops with your muse? Let me know how it's going as well in the comments down below. Um, I think this video might be a little bit of like a couple of days combined. So tomorrow we're going up to uh, Mount Fuji fifth station. So I might mesh the two together. We'll do some exploring up there as well. But I think I just got one of my, um, one of my favorite gyms. I haven't been able to get back into it, but the actual um, temple behind me here is a gym that, uh, I'm pretty proud of having that badge now. That's a really incredible badge to have, I think. So I'm gonna try and battle it down and sneak my Pokemon in there. But otherwise, guys, I'll catch you a little bit later. Um, you'll probably see this after, or you definitely see this after the live stream. Me and Alan are doing some Q&A stuff in Fuji at the moment. So I'll catch you guys then. Okie dokie guys, so we're back at the hotel now. A um, little bit annoyed. I was gonna fly my drone around um, kind of near, well not near the shrine itself, but like go to the side of the mountain and take the drone for a flight and actually like get a cool shot from a distance of like the shrine and Fuji and stuff together and all the cherry blossoms and all that wonderful stuff and you know, dream goals. Uh, but some absolute mullet <laughs> of a tourist uh, decided to fly their drone like almost crashing it into the shrine, crashed it into a tree, it nearly landed on people, security was going absolutely nuts, um, and then proceeded to be like, oh, I'm just gonna keep filming like nothing's a problem. Uh, and I was just like, oh yeah, nah, if I send up the drone now, people are gonna think that I was that person. 
um, and they're probably going to be on high alert. So I didn't really want to risk that. But um, yeah, the drone, law, the drone laws in Japan are pretty similar to Australia. So I like pretty much planned where I could and should fly it from. Um, and that location would have been fine, but just not near the shrine. Like you just wouldn't do it near the shrine. This dude like flew it almost into the shrine. So yes, maybe I'll take it for a spin tomorrow. Um, go and find a quiet spot near the lake. Uh, and take it for a bit of a bit of a spin there, but um, I'm very conscious that I don't want to fly it around people or um, near you know special sites and things like that. I wanted to fly it like further away, but still like getting a shot of the area. But um, some potatoes just got to ruin it for for everyone by almost crashing their drain into a damn shrine. It was absolutely mental. But yes. But we're going to go to, um, we've been thinking about like, what we want to do tomorrow and maybe not actually go up onto Fuji um, because there is a chance it might be raining and stuff tomorrow so the bus could get turned around. Um, so we're thinking maybe going to the like five like, the lake area and seeing like, all the flowers and everything and having a, another sneaky peek at Fuji, so yeah. And also I did hit level 39. Um, when I clicked claim the bonuses I didn't get the XP for it, so I... Um, I was like, oh, that's, that's already done. And I tapped it and I got the XP and I leveled up. So <laughs> sorry that that happened off camera, but eh, it is what it is. We level 39, we're on the home stretch to 40 now. So not long to go. So stay tuned guys. Um, I'm probably going to combine today and tomorrow's like film and stuff together. So I'll catch you guys tomorrow. Bye.